Christina Lee here for another edition of Pulse presented by the PlayStation Network. And the big news right now is the premiere of PlayStation Network's new original reality series, The Tester. We've got a peek at the first episode a little later. But first, another innovative PlayStation exclusive is just over the horizon and coming your way in the form of heavy rain. Are you prepared to suffer to save your son? In the cinematic adventure, players journey through a dark and sophisticated thriller filled with tension, emotion, intrigue, and dramatic twists. Every cop in the city on his ass. So if he moves, we know about it. Heavy Rain tells a complex story through contextual actions and realistic visuals, exploring the potential of interactive storytelling and bending storylines in this new gaming experience. Also check out the demo that's now available. And next, manipulate time so that you're in multiple places at once in Echo Shift for the PSP system. This new puzzle game brings a fun twist to the genre as players layer their actions over each other, pushing switches, bridging gaps, and much more. Resident Evil 5 is back with the first of two new playable episodes. Lost in Nightmares takes the series back to its suspenseful roots as partners Chris Redfield and Jill Valentine have to survive deadly puzzles and battle the Guardian of Insanity in the horrifying new add-on. And finally, the wildly successful Fireteam Bravo series returns to the PSP. With players leading a four-man team in an action-packed military hunt, this game has an almost limitless combination of custom missions, gear, and weapons. SOCOM U.S. Navy SEALs Fireteam Bravo 3, exclusively on the PSP system. With pitchers and catchers now reporting to Major League Baseball Spring Training, earlier this month, the cover athlete for MLB 10 The Show, American League MVP Joe Maurer, visited Sony Computer Entertainment America's San Diego Motion Capture Studio. The Minnesota Twins catcher put on a high-tech mocap suit covered in sensors for cameras to capture his moves at 120 frames per second. MLB 10 The Show's opening day is March 2nd. Opening day for PlayStation Network's new original reality series is actually today. The tester featuring 11 lucky gamers competing for a job as an actual PlayStation game tester debuts exclusively on PlayStation Network. Here's a peek at episode one of the eight-part series. I'm your host, Meredith Molinari. The 11 of you standing before me were selected from thousands of applicants to compete and land the coveted job of the next PlayStation game tester. In each episode, you will compete in challenges designed to test the essential skills required of a PlayStation game tester. PlayStation is looking for the best of the best, and they will not settle for less in their next game tester. And I'm here to see if you have what it takes. So please, bring your A-game. We'll be watching. Two words of advice for you. Just don't <laughs> suck. For the next eight weeks, a new episode of the series will be available in both high definition and standard definition for free from the PlayStation Store. And you can also watch it with friends in PlayStation Home, where you'll find each week's episode playing in theater number eight. Also keep an eye out for tester-themed rewards and items released each week. As for the top 10 PlayStation Home items, let's take a look at what you've been adding to your wardrobe and real estate portfolio. And personal spaces rule the list of top 10 items with the London Pub leading the way. Meanwhile, the romantic Paris Clock Tower apartment with its view of the Eiffel Tower comes in at number five. The Paris Clock Tower apartment is très magnifique and the perfect place to do the can-can if you can, or could if that dance was enabled, if you know what I mean. Moving over to the video side of the PlayStation Store, we begin with a dark comedy starring Matt Damon about the complications of going deep undercover. I'm approaching the entrance to the office. As a lead witness for the FBI, Mark Whitaker imagines himself a secret agent trying to become a whistleblowing hero in The Informant. Why 0014? Because I'm twice as smart as 007. But as he bumbles his way through assignments and keeps changing his story, the FBI must sort through multiplying layers of deception in this dark comedy from Steven Soderbergh. Well, I think the corporate culture's gonna change a little bit for I should you. I so. can't believe my mom didn't come to the airport. You met this guy? He's in school. Seems like she's rushing. Next, Penn Badgley stars as the son returning home to meet the new head of the household of the chilling thriller, The Stepfather. Good to finally meet you. Your return makes us complete. As he delves deeper into David's past, Michael discovers a dark and dangerous side to his new daddy. This is just how the justice system 
fucking works. And finally, the family chills continue with Gerard Butler starring as the upstanding family man who will stop at nothing to avenge his family's murder, taking revenge and justice into his own hands in the intense thriller Law Abiding Citizen. Did you murder Clarence Darby? Counselor, you might want to cancel your 1230 lunch with Judge Roberts. You will end this. I'm just getting warmed up. Here's an idea. How about Gerard Butler as Kratos if they ever make a God of War movie? And for you God of War fans, you've still got time to pick up four exclusive God of War 3 Slurpee Cups from participating 7-Eleven locations. In addition to looking badass, each cup includes a Slurpee Nation rewards code, which can be used at Slurpee.com to redeem exclusive God of War 3 content, like in-game Morpheus armor for Kratos. Mmm, Slurpee. That's all we've got time for on this edition of Pulse, presented by the PlayStation Network. I'm Christina Lee, and I'll see you right back here on March 4th. This has been a presentation of the PlayStation Network. Oh, brain freeze.